Okay, sometimes we want to find the percent ionization of a weak acid or base in a buffer solution. So here what we've done, uh, I've just put this, this is a work from a previous video um, that was just finding the pH of a buffer solution, but now what we want to do is we want to find the, uh, the percent ionization of acetic acid here, which was our weak acid. So first of all, the equation for this is really simple. We can say percent ionization, ionization, is equal to the concentration of our weak acid. Um, and we'll just save writing this out a few times, and I can just write this as HA. Um, uh, this is the concentration of our acid that has become ionized uh, over the concentration of our acid uh, that we started with. So we can write our initial. And we just multiply this by 100%. Okay, so uh, what we can do is, well, we know that our initial concentration of our weak acid here, of acetic acid, was 0 0.2 molar, so we can put that on the bottom, so 0 0.2 molar, and the concentration that became ionized is basically the, we want to find the concentration of everything that turned into its conjugate base, which is here, and that was x molar, and we can come down here and see that x, in fact, was uh, 3.6 times 10 to the negative 5. Alright, so if we want to do that, we can multiply this by 100%. And if we punch this in our calculators, we are going to get, um, this is 0.018%. Uh, and that's 0.018% ionized. Ionized. There you go. So that's just how you do that. That works for basically any um, any weak acid or weak base buffer, uh, you can find the percent ionization.